Welcome to Inside the Utah Jazz on the Belt High Dribble Network. Little J here with the Bear and JQ. Uh, JQ, what's been going in your mind after these two games? I like Ronnie Price because he plays really good. Yeah, he's been hitting those threes all night. Uh, when he gets the chance at the end of the third quarter, he hit that clutch one that got our lead back up to two. What do you have to say? I think Tracy McGrady played like a beast, but then ran out of gas in the fourth quarter, which really helped the Jazz clinch that game. Yeah, he, the Jazz just, I mean, they got him tired, kept throwing fresh bodies, as Darren Williams said, and he just got tired in the fourth quarter, two games in a row. Thank you for on the show. Um, to all those uh, Houston fans that have been hating on the Jazz, I have one thing to say. Boom shakalaka! Uh, I'm reaching into my closet. Uh, getting the broom out. I'm trying to sweep the series away. I mean, if they got this game, they got the first home game, it's going to be over. Um, Boozer, he's been putting up those 20 10. I mean, O'Kerr got some huge rebounds. Corver, I like that Shaquille O'Neal shot with one second on the shot clock. Just floated up there on your fingertips. Andre Karolinko, two games in a row, pretty solid game. Darren Williams, as Charles Barkley wanted the Jazz to do, get greedy. He finally got greedy, and he took it to the hole, and that's where he got to the free throw line. Uh, Jazz went again. Uh, they play Thursday night, uh, 10.30 Eastern, and that's all I have to say. Go Jazz.